Now, Ukraine's president has accused Vladimir Putin of war crimes. But can the Russian president be tried? And what would that entail? Moin Ode joins me now from here in Washington. He's a human rights and international law attorney. Uh, so, Moin, how difficult would it be to try Putin and his inner circle for the atrocities we've seen in Ukraine? And what are the chances of that actually happening and him being charged on a trial taking on, on war crimes charges? Yeah, thank you. Uh, I think it's not a question, uh, and it's an important question at the same time. I understand that many people want to see Vladimir Putin and his inner circle uh, on trial and uh, indicted at the International Criminal Court. Uh, it's 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 a little bit complicated than it looks because uh, although it's uh, we all uh, as uh, on media talking about criminal uh, war criminal war crime, sorry. Uh, still, uh, there's a long investigation should take uh, place in, uh, by the ICC investigators, uh, which has already opened its investigation uh, a month ago almost, and they uh, are investigating more and more crimes now, especially what happened, uh, what was exposed to, to us uh, like a couple of uh, days ago at Pucha, uh, what's happening now at uh, Mariupol at the same time. Uh, but uh, at the same time, it, it's a little bit complicated to arrest uh, anybody uh, from the uh, Russian seniors, especially that uh, Russian is, uh, Russia is not part of the uh, Rome Statute and it's not part of the ICC. At the same time, also Ukraine is not part, but Ukraine accepted uh, the ICC uh, jurisdiction over its uh, the, uh, uh, territory. So, Moni, uh, how anyway, lo Okay, so I understand it's a very complicated process. It but is, it, unfortunate. But it, could it still happen? And what are the... I guess what could what is the other legal accountability for Vladimir Putin short of him being handcuffed and arrested which you're saying is very unlikely. Well the, I think many uh, legal experts now trying to find a way how to uh, uh, put uh, or help uh, Putin accountable and uh, that uh, the easiest way will be to go to uh, European uh, courts where they have the universal uh, jurisdiction and uh, uh, put him on trial with absent because the problem with that with the international courts that they, you need to arrest and to bring the suspect to the court physically to start the, the, the trial. So 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 the whole uh, issue could be go to European courts, especially like the Americans, the Belgium one, and to uh, put him uh, and to indict him there and to indict other uh, uh, senior uh, Russians. Uh, again, we are still, unfortunately, we're still, the, the invasion, the war is still in process. We don't know about other crimes that happened in other areas. We don't know about other crimes that could take part in, in the future, especially that the Russians are pushed away from most of Ukraine, so they must, they may, might uh, make more crimes than now. The other problem will be to connect between the soldiers on the ground and the high uh, uh, officials up uh, in the in the uh, in the uh, in Moscow, and this will be also a, a long process by the prosecutors, by the investigators, to prove that what happened in in Pucha and what's happening in Mariupol now is also is a policy that's happening everywhere. Uh, so it's not easy. It's not uh, simple. It's complicated.